Last night in Hawkins Hall, two Troy University students addressed the Student Government Association concerning minority representation on this year's homecoming court. Well, I was nominated for homecoming court and I looked at the list and at first I didn't even notice anything. Um, I wasn't too worried about it and then I went back to the list and I noticed that everybody on the court or 15, 14 out of 15 of the girls were in Panhellenic sororities and then another 14 out of the 15 girls were white women and um, not to discredit any of those women at all. I think they all deserve it but like I said I do think there's more room for representation. Elston added that she believes attending an immensely diverse university should be displayed within the court considerably after taking student body ratios into account. There was some holes in the system as far as um, the selection process for senior and junior court. Um, I believe that at a 70% independent university that prides itself on being diverse, there's definitely more room for representation um, within the court. With homecoming week starting this weekend, change is unattainable this year, but there is further conversation about future changes to the court selection process. I think that there will be improvements made to this so that it can be a more fair and just and equal um, system in the best way. Uh, we really just want it to be something that's not too stressful on the girls that are running for it. Um, it's simple, but it's also efficient and equal. J. John added that the amendment under the homecoming section's code of laws were not completely followed, and the committee would meet subsequent to the SGA meeting to discuss possible changes to the election process. Zeta Ingram, Troy Trojan Vision News.